Four years ago, I got this Tweed amplifier right here. This is the Artist Tweed Tone 20R. At the time of filming, this was only available in Australia, but you can now get it in the US and also in the UK, and I'll link it down below. This particular amplifier has changed the game when it comes to small amps. I'm gonna talk about why I love this amplifier and why now so many of my friends actually own them. This thing's an absolute powerhouse and it's not your typical Tweed amp. It's not a one channel amp with very limited options. You get two extremely musical channels and I'll showcase all of the tones throughout this video. I'm gonna timestamp everything down below so you can get a good sense of how this sounds. But first, let's hear it mic'd up here in the room. Unlike a lot of tweed amplifiers, the Artist Tweed Tone has a few additional options and some modifications that you probably will get a kick out of. So we get a master output volume over here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how great it sounds even with the master volume down. So this is your global output volume. If you want the full 20 watts, crank it all the way this way. If you wanna practice at home, you can turn it all the way down. Maybe the most modern addition to this amplifier is the Digital Spring Reverb. The great news is this sounds 100% legit there's no tank in the back. It means you can move it around with it on and you're not gonna hear the spring reverb clanging around. And you're also not gonna have any problems with it up if you like to play music like surf, for example. You can crank it up as far as you like and you're never going to have any oscillation issues. Included, we also get a three band EQ and this is a global EQ. So it works on the clean channel that I showed you before and the drive channel that I'll talk about now. So this drive channel is one of the most musical. Not only does it have way more gain than something like a PV Classic 30 or a Fender Blues Junior, it's also far better once you start turning up the volume. This is loud enough to gig with without any pedals or again, you can turn the volume down and the master down and practice at home with a pretty decent tone. And being that this is a full blown valve amp, I'm pretty impressed at how it sounds even at lower volumes. The button on the top switches you between the clean and the drive channel. And this is musical with or without pedals. In this whole video, I'm just gonna show you what kind of tones you can get out of this amp at all gain settings. We get a Celestian 7080 speaker loaded into this. Now I've tried three other speakers in this cabinet from Celestian and Eminence and I keep coming back to this 7080. It's just the perfect voicing for this particular combo. This amp's loaded with 12 AX7 preamp tubes and EL84s. The great news is they haven't skimped on the quality of the valves. 
They're using full-blown JJs, which are my favorites anytime I need to replace tubes in other amps. All right, let's get into some isolated tones, starting on the clean channel. This is with the master all the way up and the volume up just a bit. It's basically just on the edge of breakup, but it's not dirty. I hope you like this tone. It's one of my favorites. Let's have a listen. <laughs> Take a look at the pushed clean amp tone. This is great if you play blues or you're going for that blues rock sound. You can just simply turn up the clean channel until it starts to break up. But the advantage of this amplifier is you can just turn down the master output so you're not blowing your ears out. Let's have a listen to this. <laughs> Let's head over to the drive channel on the amplifier. And the great thing about this is you can dial in as much gain as you like. This isn't your typical tweed amp. I'm gonna start with a lower gain tone to begin with, and then we'll crank it up as we go. <laughs> Let's switch it over to some humbuckers now. Thanks to the Harley Benton Fusion T, I'm gonna go for a cranked drive tone. I think this absolutely sings whether you're playing chords or lead. It really works great. And also take note of how great the reverb sounds in all of these samples. <laughs> Up next, I'm gonna crank up the drive even more. So you're gonna hear the gain pretty much dimed. And the great news is I can work that master volume control and turn it down if I need to as well. So you can play like this in any volume and we'll get to that in just a moment. But have a listen to these high gain tones paired with the Harley Benton. <laughs> If you're enjoying the video so far, please leave a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. it helps so much. So thank you again for all of your support. Now, what we're going to do now is test out some bedroom or lower volume settings. So you can use the master volume to bring that down as much as you want. Now, in post, I've cranked this up a few dB on the recording just to make it easier for you guys to hear. But the great news is you can still record great clean tones and really great drive tones at a much lower level. Let's have a listen. <laughs> And now we're over to the drive channel at just above a conversation level. So if you're in a situation where you can't be too loud, you can still make this amp work. It does feel a little bit different to play at lower volumes, but here are the tones. <laughs> Let's wrap this video up. I'm gonna talk about why this is the only 20 watt amplifier you'll ever need. So I've owned Blues Juniors. I've had a classic 30 here at the house. I've tried many different 15 and 20 watt amps over the years, and this thing is so versatile. It's more versatile than any Blues Junior I've ever played. We get more gain on that drive channel. The drive channel also sounds far better than the PV Classic 30, although if you want that lower gain sound of the Classic 30, you can dial that in as well. The speaker is the perfect match for this cabinet, and the overall output volume is loud enough to gig with. 
I used to play out every Sunday night for years and three of my other friends now own this amplifier and they're always loud enough in the room, <laughs> as is this guy. So I've used this out so many times that I would have a hard time recommending any other amp, especially even at double the price almost over this. This Artist Tweet Tone 20R will fill a room, no problems at all. You get that great clean channel that works great with pedals, or of course you can just dial in the drive channel and get a really great tone. This Artist Tweet Tone amp is fantastic. I hope you like this video. If you want to check it out, I'll link it down in the description below. Thanks for watching.